Hi, my name is Barrington Miller, and this is another episode of Tech Tuesday at Canada's Farm Show, formerly known as the Farm Progress Show. And today I'm here with Mark Devlo. Mark, tell us why I'm here and what mud scrapers do. Yeah, hi, Mark Devlo. Um, we started this in 2011, built uh, mud scrapers for our own use on the farm, uh, just to maintain seed depth and fertilizer depth throughout the fields. And uh, since then, realized how good it was working for ourselves and decided to uh, start hitting the trade shows and having the opportunity for other farmers to purchase product and use it in their own farms. So at Tech Tuesday, we like to talk about inventions and things that help make life easier. So this device, actually, if we move the camera a little bit over here, scrapes the mud off and it helps during the germination process so that you can put more things down. That's right, just to keep it consistent. So if you get any buildup on any of the tires, what it does is it lifts the seed out of the ground. So your seed and fertilizer placement isn't where you'd like to have it. We've got precision seeders that we spend a lot of money on. And if you don't have the precision in the wet times, you just don't have the accuracy. So we're in Saskatchewan and last year the climate I think was a little bit rainy, a little bit muddy. How were your sales uh, with this product last year? We had average sales last year but this year is where we really had the rain. Okay. We had a lot more moisture this uh, this past spring across the prairies and we really did see a big increase in sales because everybody was needing it and it was kind of a last minute thing. Uh, a lot of us don't realize what we need for sure until uh, the last minute and a lot of guys are driving out from all over the province to uh, to come and get the scrapers just to keep be able to get in the fields and keep on going one of the things that might separate this product from other products is competition who are your competitors are there any is there anybody else doing or making something like this yeah there, as far as I'm concerned there's really no com competitors out there because there is a stationary scraper that is on the market for I, I think only one or two seeders now different uh, different seeding tools in my opinion I mean obviously I don't want to be biased here but in my opinion okay, be biased. It, is, it is what it is right uh, a stationary scraper creates more friction and more wear uh, they can plug up a lot easier um, I mean if you swamp this tire with this scraper on there's a good chance you can fill it up with mud too but on average these are working very good and they don't they don't put friction as much friction on the tire as soon as they're, they're offset for a reason as soon as the mud touches them it spins the scraper and uh, there's just less friction and wear so uh, put this in context the farmer is able to work longer work more productively use less fuel because there's less stopping and starting and, and cleaning and all of those things so he really really does have a good product now can this be retrofitted onto any type of machine yeah we've got it on most seeding tools out there um, seed hawk seed master borgos all the borgos um, amity new holland i mean just trying to think con Cords, John Deere, quite a few. Oh, that's awesome. Well, Mark, listen, on behalf of the Canadian Securities Exchange and, of course, farms.com, don't forget to check out their website. I just want to say thank you for taking the time of explaining your awesome invention and best of luck. Thank you very much.